Alright, so welcome back to LSD Dream Emulator with me, Mudahar. That one dude who plays video games and reads creepypasta. So we're going to start from day number five, as we last left off in the magical land of LSD Dream Emulator. Which, by the way, I must admit, it's not about LSD, the drug. It is just about sweet dreams. Really sweet dreams. No way related to drugs. I don't fucking believe that for a second, though. Uh, you see, I don't fucking like this very much. Now, apparently, last time, people who were, uh, oh, shit. People who decided to, you know, tell me a little bit more about the game told me that I should not walk into the Shadow Man. Because the Shadow Man takes me to bad places. And, uh, that's not good. Now, I'm going to listen to your advice, because most of the time, you guys are really nice individuals. Holy fuck, something better not pop up. Now, this game is generally just disturbing. A lot of people, you, know, you seem to enjoy it, so I'm glad that you're getting what you want, you know. I mean, this is a channel that's run by the community, really. Versus me, Mudahar. And I like that. Now, for those wondering why I can't... Oh, oh shit, I'm sorry. Fucking teddy bear fucks me up there. Alright, let me just go there. Wait a minute, is that Uboa? Holy shit, look at the TV at the fucking bottom uh, left. That is Uboa, guys. It's fucked up. No, I think we're gonna walk right in there. Why not? Man, this place ain't fucking normal. See, we're back to the. Oh. Well, it's not like we could get out of there. Oh, it's probably another, like, ramp that lead it up. Leads up. Oh shit, there's something there, guys. But yeah, this game just gets more and more disturbing. I know I know some of you guys wrote that like by the 60th day this game gets like really fucked up. And you know, what the fuck? Is that a goddamn like demon or some shit? Anyways. But by like day 60, 70, I'm gonna be so fucked. Oh, dude, this is a nuclear explosion again, right? Let me just, uh, change some settings on my computer here. Because it sounds a little fucking weird. Alright, I get it. <coughs> what the hell is this? Seems like some fucking base. So we're gonna get Star Fox up in this bitch. But it's interesting to see, like, how was this game coded in pro -grand? I'm sorry, I thought the way it was, like, fading in. I was like, shit, we're in Demon Land. But, like, I gotta ask one question, though. Like, I mean, I, I mean I, I'm a programmer, so it's kind of interesting to play this game to see how, you know, they fucking coded it and everything, because it's a really bizarre fucking game, I mean, I gotta think about it, like, these games get playtested, who the fuck playtested this game here, man, it's, it's fucking crazy up in this bitch, dude, look at this place, and to think about it, like, the art style here, like, the people who were writing these games, were like, the fucking, what the hell is that, man, that thing's got a mouth, motherfucker, jeez, man, it's fucking crazy. You're gonna tell me they're not fucking made out of thunder and shit. That's, that's... Well, dude, there's a question mark. See, I might get to the mystery lane. I might either get something. See, the question mark means one common thing. Okay, it means either good things happen or you got. Oh, what the fuck was that? Is that fucking Pingu on crack? Fuck that shit, dude. Holy shit, what the fuck was that? <laughs> this motherfucking Pingu on crack, dude. That is fucking crazy. I know I'm like freaking out over it, but like shit. Some fucked up shit right there. Wait, can I go into it? <laughs> can I go into it? So fucking mature. Dude, that is that is fucked. What? Dude, Pingu, you're a fucking piece of shit. He's spawning back here. Dude, it's little Pingu! Oh my god, he had babies. Oh man, fuck that shit. I'm gonna talk to the baby. 
See, who fucking coded this shit, man? The amount of stuff- they have to have been taking some medic- Whoa, why are we back in the same place again? I feel like now I'm gonna fight, like, uber big boss of the Pingu, you know? Now it's gonna be, like, fucking, you know, Metal Gear Solid- Holy shit, it's turning fucking red! Okay, we got an upper there, what? Okay. Alright, man, shit! I, I guarantee you, because the thing is, it takes, like, from the first day, and it fucks- it goes over to the next couple days, too. So- it's like, what the fuck's gonna happen now? Like, am I gonna get, like, a Pingu zombie massacre here? Or, like, are the penguins never gonna show up? And why the hell do they show up in the first place? That's the question. You know, these are the things you should be asking throughout this playthrough here. Because you don't fucking know what you find. Like, I mean, last time I saw, like, this non-fucking, this weird-ass, like, you know, head thing. And I was like, oh, fuck that. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, the fucking sun's here, too. God damn it. That's an evil sun, man. That's like the fucking, you know, Antichrist or some shit being born here, dude. Hell. This ain't good fucking time. That's for damn sure. I think this is like a hub area. Because we've been here before, and it's like, you can kill yourself in that main center there. Or you can touch one of these. And man, when the frame rate, like, gets normal, this guy runs like fucking Sonic on speed. Uh oh, in the down there. And those are states here are mine, I'm sorry, those aren't really like... What? Where the fuck are we? We're in like, Hyrule fucking field right here, dude. Skeleton's gonna fucking... Na -na 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 -na. No, fuck not the tree. Okay, I went into that a bunch of time in the first fucking episode. And I'm sorry if I sound like, high or something in this. Because when you react to shit in this game... Like, those are like, I mean, you gotta think about it for a second, man. You, your brain has to comprehend some of the shit this game's gonna throw at you. And I'm only fearing what I find later on, but as far as I know, this isn't like full of screamers or some shit, you know? Like, usually that would, oh, what the fuck was that? See? Like, look at what I'm talking about. What is that, man? Is that a goddamn TV? Oh, are we gonna go over there and watch Suicide Mask in this bitch? You know, watching 1080p? What the fuck is that? Is that... Is that a fucking... Is that, is that, is that, is that human fucking biology right here? I remember back in science class, they showed us like some weird ass shit, you know? Well, let's see what's over here. Cause in like science class back in the day, they showed us like, when they were going into like sex ed and shit. And this was like later sex ed, you know, in the first, in like, in like grade four sex ed, they teach you fucking nothing, it's like, oh god, there's penises, and back in the day, we didn't know what a fucking penis was, the fucking teacher didn't even know what a goddamn penis was, and she was like, oh, well, I heard on TV, they call it a Johnson, like, really? God damn, sorry, I'm just going into like some stupid tangent. But that's kind of what this game is sort of reminding me of, but I think that's the charm of this game. Let's go over here. I'm not gonna go there because I've already been there last time. So I'm gonna go down this one. This game, this game will be truly fun. See, that's a yellow one. That's another building. And I gotta give them credit, dude. They really spent a lot of time making this game. Alright, so man, look at this shit. I don't wanna see what the whole place has to offer, really. And, and, like, the thing is, everything I touch gives me something. So, for example, that TV offered a benefit, or a detriment, or it changes the whole game in a way. So, the replayability of this entire game is kind of up in air, man. Like, you could fucking do anything with this shit, dude. And it's really impressive. I gotta, like, the more I play this game... And this isn't the first time I played LSD Dream Emulator, mind you. I, I, like I said, I played it back in the day to record for gameplay footage. And oh, we're waking up! No! What? We're back here? That sucks. But back when I played it, you know, it was it was a different kind of game. You know, like I sat there and, and like when when the first time I played it, I, I saw dead bodies in like that violence district that people dub. And, you know, ever since that day, I've been more and more, like, declined to do the series. Because, like, the thing is, every time I watch a series of this game, because I, I do watch playthroughs to sort of, like, understand what I'm even getting myself into. Not to spoil the game or anything, or learn some valuable hints or cheats, but to see what I'm...
Oh, fuck. What does this mean? What is that bird fucking doing? Oh, oh shit, oh shit man, it's like a 3D effect here. It's about to go 3D if this game had a remake. So what do the birds mean? That's the first time I came this far. Alright, so that wasn't really, uh, that wasn't really a... I think that was a dream, but it wasn't a playable dream, so we're on day 8. Like I said, this game is just an obscure kind of game, and I don't know, like, this, this was released in limited quantity. So it's an interesting title, I gotta say, and I'm glad people can get it now on uh, PlayStation Network, although you have to be in Japan, you know, because I was totally in Japan, you know, if you can pull it off, but it's, I mean, I just gotta say, this game is fucking weird, and I just forgot what I was gonna say, too. But, like, oh, no, sorry, I remember. But, like, the people that were playing this game or the people that I watched for, like, you know, like, maybe a video or something, those people didn't really fucking finish the game. They played for, like, what, a couple episodes, and they just fucking stopped and i was like why would they stop you know like what is the rationality behind that like why are they just stopping these playthroughs and this one guy apparently and i don't remember the name exactly it's some fucking it's late right now claimed that the game he was playing it while he slept so i'm like what and so that's why i've been more and more kind of reclined to do this game because i don't know what i'm getting myself into but you know ever since i posted that video a couple days back i'm full flushed into it man and i just gotta keep playing it you know until i beat it what the fuck where are we now it's it's the same field except a red sky so it's like this game is a legit creepypasta game, man. <laughs> it falls into everything. Fucking crazy, dude. I'm gonna follow him. Maybe it might take me somewhere cool. Even though they're like outrunning me, though. Oh, oh shit, they disappeared, dude. They ran off into the fucking air. See, the sound, as far as I can hear, sounds like some chaff grenade went off in Metal Gear. I don't know where I am, dude. Dude, is that a fucking turtle now? Holy shit. Yo, it's fucking disappearing, dude. Holy fuck. Uh-oh, that's not a good sign, is it? Oh! Oh shit, the shadow me. Need to bring me back? Dude, Shadow Man shows up back and forth, dude. I don't like that guy. Shadow Man, he's a real piece of shit, apparently, I heard. See, now there's a foot statue. I don't know if that's different, actually. I think this game is an early precursor to Grand Theft Auto. The way the uh, technicals are working, the occlusion effects. Not the occlusion effects, either. what is that? The calling, yeah. I think that's what they call it. See, those things freak me out. I'm not going to touch those, man. Those are fucking weird. But, like, I mean, the thing about it is, like, this game is a disturbing game, though, you know? Like, it's not like it's gory or, like, it's atmospherically, like, weird. Well, it is, but it's just disturbing, you know? Because, like, everything you play in this game, it's an unexpected thing. And I, that's why, as a programmer, I'm also baffled as to, you know? How this game is coded too, it's so efficiently done, man. It's, it's where are we now? I'm gonna go into this rock. Okay. See now we're back at this uh now we're back at this hub world. Which again doesn't really offer me what I'm looking for. I think I'm just gonna hit another Oh shit 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 no 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 Not today motherfucker not today not today not today 
took that thing, man. Holy shit. That's one thing I don't like in this game. So we're back here now, you know? Like, this. There's really not a whole lot of diverse locales. Oh shit, holy fuck, I thought something was gonna pop up there. See, I'm only back here again, I'm not really expanding out of that. It's just a Tetris thing, really. Oh, let me save the game here. Alright, day number nine. Woo, give it up for day number nine. Huh. I don't know what I was gonna pop up over here though. I just went into the pillar. Pillar time. Come on, let's go. Load up. Let's go to the bar, man. I need to get fucking hammered after all this. This game, I can imagine if you have to like pop a couple beers before you touch this. Why is this place green? This place isn't supposed to be green. He's just running. Alright, here he goes. Oh, dude, we're back at that fucking beach with the weird ass, like, sign. No, I'm not going to the sign again. Fuck that sign. I'm gonna go onto the beach. I'm gonna see what weird. Wait, is that something weird? Holy shit. What the fuck is that, man? Is that Echo? Dolphin? No, it's a fucking shark. No, 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 I touched the shark before. Not not now, okay? No, 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 not the shark anymore. Let's go this way. Was that the tree of life, man? Imagine we found the Deku tree up in this bitch, dude. That'd be... That'd be the shit. What? Sorry, I tried to go through that one little gap, but I ended up walking into the red pillar. Fastest teleportation right there. Man, we're back here again? Fuck. You know, fuck it. I don't really like this place, man. I'm gonna go this way. I'm not gonna lie, man. You can't play this game for a long fucking time. The only reason is these D-pads are really fucking with my thumbs. I think by the end of this playthrough... I don't know how many parts it's going to be. My thumbs are going to be completely destroyed. I'm uh, just saying. My thumbs are sacrificing themselves for your enjoyment. Just remember that. Nah. This is what I love to do. If y'all can tell by... Oh, not liking this. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. This is the violent district. This is a district with a really fucked up shit. I don't like it, man. I don't like this district. This district's not a cool district to be in, you know? Like, who the fuck's gonna go out here at night, man? Like, you've gotta be one dumb motherfucker, dude. Like, you're not here, okay? I don't know how safe Tokyo really is, but I'm pretty sure you can get your ass to- What the fuck is that? Beat Street up in this bitch? What? What is this? There are eyes on the wall! I heard about this shit, dude! Oh, fuck, now it's going to start to get disturbing, too. Oh, fuck. What? Is this is a fucking 1997 E3 tech demo? I'm a fuck, I'm going to walk right into it. See, that weird shit's just going to start happening. 
they need to make a mod, man, for like, you know what? You know what this company really needs to kind of do, or like a fan? What the fuck? Is that fucking Rat No, that's the elephant. Holy shit, I was like, that's Rattata? What? What? That's fucked up, man. And that ain't cool, bro. But you know, you know what they need to really, really work on here is they, they really gotta like bring this game back to life. I mean, I have not seen a game like it. Like the closest thing I have to this game to play. Oh, that's what it is. Oh, okay. So it's a brown char charm, gar charm. Shit. See, that's what happens. Char charm. See, charming and gar charm combined. If they fucked, that's what would happen. But like, see, the closest thing I can get to this is like Yumi Nikki. That's not really like this, so that's. I mean, yeah, that's fucking random as hell too. But you know, it's not like this where. <laughs> Fuck! Every episode is gonna be an adventure. Oh, we're waking up. Oh, see, so you made some progress over to that side. The dynamic side. I think that dynamic. Okay. Day ten. Day ten. Day ten. Day ten. Day 10. Day 10, bro. Day 10. We're getting there. Day 2 now. 